Question 35. Sketch the graph of y equals the square root of 2x minus 2. So this is a radical graph. And we could do this graph in two ways. We could do it as a, a radical graph where we graph the parent function 2x minus 2. And then we apply the square root tool to our y values. Or we could do this as a transformation of the square root of x. I'll do it as graphing the line first. So the first thing we want to do is we're going to sketch the graph of y equals 2x minus 2. So as we know, 2x minus 2, we have a y-intercept of minus 2. This is slope-intercept form and a slope of 2. Of course, we know slope is being rise over run, but we'll write it as the fraction uh, just so that we can see each value separately. So on the minus 2, here I am, and now I'm going to rise 2, up 2 over 1, up 2 over 1, up 2 over 1. So I'll just label this axis 2, 3, 4, 5. So do one more. 2 over 1. So we'll graph this straight line. So during your test, make sure you use a ruler to do this. But I'll try my best. Given my technical limitations. Alright, so this is not the answer to the question, so we clearly want to label that this is uh, 2x minus 2. Next to the equation. So y equals 2x minus 2. So now we got to apply, we'll apply absolute value. So now we're going to sketch uh, y equals the square root of 2x minus 2. So let's look at some very good points. One important point is y equals 0. That will stay the same. And so will y equals 1. That will stay the same. Uh, a point, if we look at a y value of 4, the square root of 4 is 2. So that'll come here. And then that's basically about it. Remember, for these negative y values, that is not going to be in your graph because you cannot find the square root of the negative number. So here's what our new function looks like. And again, this would be on a non-calculator part. So you want to, you know, show that 1 staying the same. Show the 0 staying the same and then show the 4 becoming a 2. So your graph uh, of the square root of 2x minus 2 is done. And notice the domain is uh, in set notation x is greater than or equal to 1.